in this order. Um, I know we just handed them out, but if you had a chance to look at the agenda. We don't have July 26th summer open house on, on for you know, new business. How much should be there? July, yeah, I needed it. Yeah. What did you say? Um, the July 26th summer open house. We need to probably have that in new business. Oh, let's talk about the green items from the board. Okay. And also, we can, we can bring it up without it being on here. Unless you want to make it a joint amendment to the agenda. Yes. Yeah, I think that's what you're doing, isn't it? I think that's okay. what I'm doing, is the yeah, amendment yeah. agenda, just to include that, because it was something that was pretty sweet. Okay, I have it done on this. And then, yeah. and then um, this, the past and present board member wall project is no longer an old business thing, it's more of a future agenda um, item, because it goes now along with the house manager picture project. Um, because those two uh, projects will be uh, assembled and um, placed at the same time. So that's Karen, I'm sorry, I'm having trouble hearing you this morning, so. <laughs> I'm sorry. The um, 5C, uh, the past and present board member wall project is no longer an old business matter. It's now part of future agenda items because it goes along with the house manager picture project that we've planned. And that all of that is going to be happening at the same time. Okay. Because it's all with respect to the walls upstairs. Okay. All good then? Uh -huh. Those okay. changes? Thanks. Thanks to you. Thank you. Alrighty. So we've got those approved. Um, now, everybody had a chance to look at the minutes. They were sent out. Mm -hmm. okay. Any um, changes or additions? I suggest one deletion, and that is on page three. Um, the last bullet point of the future agenda items, clean the stairs hall closet, uh -huh. that was not on the agenda for sure. reading. Mm -hmm. I knew but, there was something that I put on the but you, but you were wonderful because you did get it in the content where we did discuss it and said, yes, let's put that on it for so future. So just to be from just that number one, nine. Yes, just that one line from number nine. So you beautifully covered it. Let me get a picture too. <clears throat> okay, if that's all then, um, can I get a motion to approve the minutes? I so move. I second. Thank you. I'll approve. Bye. Bye. Remember to vote this time. <laughs> yes. Yay. Okay. Um, number three is public invited to be heard. No public. Um, number four is discuss items from packet updates. Um, what is that? What is that? Yeah. I am aware of that. Honestly, I'm not sure. <laughs> I, so I'm these to me. I, I want to think that it has to do with anything that's in the packet. Is that right? Oh, yeah, so I can show it. Right. Okay, we didn't have a lot of extra stuff. No. I, yeah, I've got a couple things. things. So I was going to talk about this. Picture, but I've got a little thing. I'll just do that under items for staff. Okay, so we'll move along here. Um, old business, then. we will start moving to that. Oh, can I pause for just a second? Yeah. Ask one quick question regarding the minutes. What, what is the link to um, the public to view all previous minute meetings? I have no idea. I can find it. To see the minute video? meeting minutes. Oh, Sorry, minutes. I said that wrong. I said that backwards. The minutes, yeah. Sure. Not the video, the minutes. So once we've got our minutes and we've submitted them, where's, where's the, the link, link that the public can access minutes. the minutes? It's a little bit. I don't know, but also. Yeah, I think it's there. I remember finding it like while I was applying to the board. But right. Right. It's just it's super cool. Cool. I'll send it to you guys. You can't find it. it. Yeah. yeah. You gotta look. That would be helpful. Thank you. To determine can find it. Right. That's okay. Okay. Um, so let's go to um, item A on old business status of uh, the grant project. And then I think I'll let you talk about yeah, So um, they're working, working now, but uh, wrapping up this session of work, they've done what where they really focused was on the windows um, and then the planning for concrete. We had thought maybe the concrete would get done before this point, but it didn't. That's okay. Um, 
So they've really focused, the, the concrete plan is set, so we, we looked at the mix, and I showed you guys some pictures of that. Mm -hmm. um, and the windows have been the main focus. So, but then we're gonna take a break as of this week. Um, they're done because now we have a wedding this weekend. We have, I think it's four weddings in the next month. And then middle of July, they'll they'll pick up again full speed. And yeah, so that's that's where it's at right now. So the windows are at the end. Done? No, no, no. No, no but they've been, they've been working on them, fitting them, they, you know, working on paint, making sure paint color and uh, you know it's the green and green that we had talk, all talked about at the paint um, and then there's a base color out there too like in the, in the upper eave that um, we're going to match so yeah that's where that that's where that stands right now how long is the pause for a month, a month. until that yeah these these events are done so the green and green colors that we saw in yeah. the paint analysis yeah. presentation yeah. is what's being painted mm -hmm. okay and then um with respect to the curved window what's the progress on that is this what's happening with it that's just in process i, I don't have a specific update on the curved window but it's a part of everything else and, okay. uh, <coughs> so i don't have a specific update on that. okay and then what is the uh, approach for the protective I don't know if it's going to be a glazing or if it's a protective layer of an exterior, you know, protection for all of the leaded and um, stained glass windows. The ones that are not covered, or no, the one all, all of them because it's all of them. That was oh, the glass, glass itself. It's a tempered glass that will be over. Okay, so it's a tempered glass mm -hmm. that's going to be on the exterior of uh -huh. the existing historic yeah. glass. So, wonderful. Yeah. That'll be on all the leaded windows. And stained glass. Yes. So all of that was included in your chicken. That is that's wonderful. Yeah. Would that be like the a storm window on the outside that's tempered yep. glass? Yep. Yeah. Yep, and should be much more attractive than the, the ones you see over here with the that have gotten so yep. well, you know, sort of mm -hmm. over the years. Yeah. Um, oh. and I'm I am meeting um, I'll have a little more update even though they won't have restart work because I'm actually meeting with Kevin the contractor next week um, so I'll have a, a more update directly from him where where we're at right now as far as the pause and where we're going so when we get together next time we'll have a little bit more information because I'm also going to talk to him about a couple things on the inside we're scheduled for the 20th including this and talking about that wall upstairs Question. Which is not a part of the plan. Right. So right. Is, is the delay in the concrete just out of curiosity? Is it some of it to do with all the extra moisture that we received? Honestly, I don't know. I, I, I think it's more timing, trying to get the timing down. Is that now there access to electricity? Is that why it's uh, no, it's like you can open it? There's some water. There was a water damage. damage. There was that paneling no issue. But there's screws there. there. Nowhere else has screws. I mean, it's the only. I haven't climbed up there, but that's like I said. But that's we're gonna. I'm gonna meet him on and no. talk to him as a separate. Since these guys are here, can we pay them a little bit separately? Is a separate deal. Yeah, they're the right guys. Exactly. Yes. They're the right guys. Right. Right. Yes. Right. Yes. 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 There's that piece there, and then there are damage ways on the wall. Here is it that piece into the wall panel here? Into the burlap panel. Into the burlap. The burlap slip. Yep. Yep. That's what I was looking at. So, good plan. One last question about the window. They, they do plan to do the restoration with it in in place. They're not going to take the window out. The main window, the, I, the, the curved, curved one, I do not know yet. Okay, but they're not going to replace the material, right? They're not going to replace the the I guess the the framing of it. They're and they're, not, and they're not going to replace the leaded. Glass. Uh, right. no, that would not be a part of the yeah. That's not restoration. That would be mm -hmm. replacement. Right. I want to make sure we're clear about that because that's what happened with the flat one and we can't have that happen again. So. That's my understanding. Thank you. Great. Um, thank you, Julie. Thank you.
Oh, there we go. Sorry. So, Sue Ellen's reminder of me. Yeah. Married on Monday. That's wonderful. That's great for very happy work. All right. So, um, can we move on to the Kirby project on Third Avenue? And that one was completed by the city and discussed it with Historic Board um, on the first, Historic Commission, I'm sorry. <laughs> on the first, and it is in place, and they mirrored the look, um, if not the mix or color. Um, that was something that, uh, and appreciated that the city did that, that went that extra distance. Um, that will link, I can actually talk about the picture in here, because that links to um, the picture, which is, a, I think, a thing of interest, which the box you see in here is actually the historic, designated property area and if you notice that the, the third avenue actually is not so it never know. went when they gifted it they the what callahans the yeah. callahans didn't have the the access or the curb access of Bullion period is that what you're saying i'm saying that the callahan house property highlighted below is applicable to the local historic landmark designation yes that's that's what we were explaining. So I bought a copy of the ordinance one two two nine, and it provides a legal description. Here, let me go ahead. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Everyone, and I think you already have that. And um, and ladies, I think um, um, last year you you may already still have that, but um. But I definitely know that uh, our, our newest members don't have it because they, they weren't part of the retreat last year. Um, that is the that is the ordinance that provides the designation of the landmark and the official uh, legal description. And I think, and just because this is a picture, and even just looking at the picture, I'm not sure it's accurate because it appears that it excludes the pillars out front, which I don't imagine that's really what the intent was. I think it's just kind of a, an aerial picture, fairly new, and, and this highlight um, may or may not be completely accurate. I, just feel, I guess I just want to point back to the, the fact that if we want to talk about the property and, and it's legal description or, or make sure that there's any reference to the property, then we always have to refer back to the um, legal description, which is record, recorded both with, um, obviously, with the city under ordinance number 1229, but also with Boulder County Clerk and Recorder under the warranty deed um, from the Callahan's to the house, which again, it does state that, that South 30, S30 feet of Lot 4, in all of lots five and six in block 62, City of Loma. So I, I, I hesitate a little bit when we put pictures out there because I think it can be a little, uh, it could be mistaken. Um, but again, like, you, can you see what I'm talking about where, you know, just outside this line? That's the entry, those are the pillars that hold the gate to the entry of the of the driveway. You don't, it doesn't mean to be right here. Yeah, you, you don't uh, mean to exclude that, do you? You're, you're asking, I'm not a historian or on the board, so I'm not going to comment on it. Okay, who did you get this from? The street folks who were doing the research on it. Okay, street folks with the city. Mm -hmm. Okay, so employees of the city doing the, the, were they employees of the city or contractors of the city? Employees of the city, as far as I know. Okay, but they're the ones do, that were doing work on the um, street. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Well, I just would caution anyone to look at well, well, like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, absolutely. I, guess. I, I think this is one of those things that if it's saying it's in existence and this is what it is, and yet this is actually where it is. That's the legal yeah, legally legally legally. Legally. It, it has to go by this, and this yeah. is one of those things that this then needs to be corrected. Well, I don't, again, I'm about images, I get a little concerned about that because it could, 
It could be mistaken. So it, somebody could look at this and say, oh, well, that means that the, the pillars that hold the gate um, at the end of the driveway are not part of the legal description of this property. When that's really, I don't believe that's accurate. I, I agree that this. So the ordinance and the warranty deed, which is recorded with the clerk and recorder of Boulder County and in the assessor's office. The, yeah. These are the legal documents that provide the legal description for the property. And Ben, I have a question. So you presented this to the Historic Preservation Commission. How is that possible when that meeting was canceled? After. We did that on the first. You did it on the first? Uh, and, they, uh, in the first. there at the other one, but they, they didn't okay. have a quorum. They didn't have a quorum. And right. then, and, and that was after the fact, though, because the the mm -hmm. um, concrete had already been demolished. Mm -hmm. okay. All right. Did any of that carbon get saved after the fact? I liked, I mean, if the city was just going to push forward with it anyway, well, we didn't have much of a say on it. But I liked uh, Brittany's suggestion of at least saving to use some term? portion of the Did concrete. Did any of the curve board? Not that I know. But I can look into it. Because that was a wonderful suggestion to, to have a historic concrete. Exactly like what the it's <laughs> like what the Molly Brown did with with Molly yeah. Brown did with converting it in a piece of um, art jewelry to wear. That, I that was they used to do this fundraiser. And yeah, they fundraise it. So it's an idea. Anyway, hmm. right, yeah, Rob, for the driveway. <laughs> Can we please just be more included? Not that we're going to interfere. Can we be included in this process as things are happening more? I will include you on every information item that I have, which I have done. Okay. It was just disappointing to be driving by and have work gone. And knowing that it had it hadn't from keeping on top of things and, and watching the Historic Preservation Commission when they had stated that they would have wanted to know more about the information before they voted on it. And mm -hmm. after the fact, when it's already been demolished, they can't really do anything. So there was no point, in my opinion, to even come back and present to them when it's already been demolished. Um, I don't, it should have been put on hold, particularly since they requested it to me. I don't understand why it was demolished before they even had a chance to vote. That's something I find disturbing. And then we as a board as, as well had said that we preferred to preserve it. And um, we wanted to know um, at, if possible. And I just don't know what, by demolishing it, really what it served. Did it really make any difference in, in the water, um, the, the moving of the water or anything like that? I mean, that, that concrete there was 150 years old and I, I just don't understand really other than I, I just quite don't understand the even the engineering reasoning behind it um, it seems a shame that we lost that and we also lost the curving on, on, on Terry um, when it should have gone through the right boards and commissions as as it has been set up in the city and it was just overlooked Okay. What I was told is it was under a failure. That, that it, it was falling apart. That it was. Crumbling. It was falling apart and crumbling. Mm -hmm. Okay, but we didn't know that. We hadn't been told that. We we had been told that it needed to be replaced. When we we stated in our thing specifically, I remember stating, I understand if it's falling apart, if there's a water reasoning or something along those lines, and the statement back in. Of course, Ben, my, my memory could be faulty on this, but the statement back was no, you didn't believe that was the case. It was just that they were going to be fixing all of it on, on that area. Okay. Uh, it, well, both things are true. It was a part of the process, but as they're going through, that, that material is falling apart. They couldn't, there was no way they were going to connect, is what I've been told. Okay. This is not me, this is what I've been told. Mm -hmm. That there was no way that was to save that 
while you're trying to update the waterway there, the road, the drainage. Okay. That's what I was told. But we did, and we did mention in a meeting when we were told it's going to happen. And I came back and I said this was the plan. Yes. Yeah. So. When we were told it's going to happen, we said, can we take a portion of that and can we do it? And, and, and to bring a great idea. But also, her. I suggested you need to include our contractor who's going to be pay, take, taking care of the concrete of the driveway. Perhaps that's going to be the best sample to use to match. And, and to be fair, it, Karen, and I apologize, I, I know I am interrupting, but I do not believe Ben was at that meeting. Um, Sue Ellen was, but I do not I believe that was the meeting that Ben missed and wasn't there when we stated that. And and that's one of those things that... that I did not just, know the day they were going to do that. Okay. I did not know. When I came for a different a meeting for the for the grant, it was being done. What date was it done on that? What the round? I don't recall. I mean, is there a chance we can find that? Where did they take the concrete? Yeah. I, well, I, I did come by and I took pictures in the video before it got taken out, um, and with the signs in the mine and the um, and I did, just so you know, as a citizen, separate from the board, not representing the board, send an email to City Council um, regarding my concerns. And um, if you'd like, I can share that email with you. It's public record at this point, of course. Um, but um, it, it just, it's, it's alarming that um, these things happen without pause for community voice, and that includes not just us, but the Historic Preservation Commission. Um, they really had no input on it either, and that's unfortunate. Um, while we can certainly all appreciate the need for safety, and um, I guess concern for any water uh, flow, um, if something excessive or, or a, a large change like that needs to happen. Well, so be it. But it it, it should not just be forced, and it should not um, exclude the um, the community or the citizens or the volunteers serving on the boards. Um, and but rather, it should include the opportunity for discussion about it at the very minimum. And that that discussion, while may lead to. Well, the end result is yes, unfortunately, has to be torn out. In the process, it could have been confirmed, you know, it is historic concrete. Yes, we could use it in part to help our contractors match it for the driveway restoration. And yes, we could use it in part for potential future fundraising uh, opportunity, like what was done with Valley Molly Brown House the concrete, the historic concrete. I mean, it's, there are, Things that are beyond just the structure that need to be considered, and I think that's where our voice needs to be included. I, I think the thing that I find most disturbing is that um, supposedly we have these safety nets in the city that will help preserve um, historic properties or historic things, and time and time again, they've been um, overlooked, and we've lost houses, and we've lost other things because. It, it was uh, overlooked. This house that used to be back here that was on the National Registry, it was on the National Registry. The Civil Rights that was the famous house. Mm -hmm. it, it, it may seem small about the concrete, but it, it has larger implications. That's the thing I want to disturb. And, in, and one of the things that I think we should do, speaking about this and looking at the picture, I do think it should be properly measured, and we should have a, 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 a new picture redone. Because if this is what's left, and this is what's put into the engineering, and this is what they're basing everything off of from now on, um, let's correct it. Because again, once something's gone, it's gone, you can't go back. And, and you can match it, but this is the, the history is gone. So if we really truly look at the measurements from what we have as the legal description, truly please, and have it in here. I think it's important. 
I will pass that. Thank you. Okay. Um, any other input on the curbing project? That was great. Um, okay, we're going to skip C until Donald Carter. Um, D, committing for policy for donations and contributions. Um, who's talking for that one? Anybody? I can. Okay. Yeah, so we um, have met and gathered a great draft items. Uh, I think we probably need to meet one more time. At least, probably, I think we can finish with one more meeting and have that ready for approval by the board next month. Um, but yeah, basically, we're the gist of it is, and obviously, we'll get to review it, but just to give you a gist. Oh, thanks, Karen. Um, <laughs> there you go. Just is, in case you want to yeah, thanks. Um, you know, overall, it's kind of steer people towards making a donation to the house fund, um, but having some other options for the potential of accepting in kind donations, maybe of historic nature. Um, I spoke with Eric Mason about what the museum does for that, and he gave us some guidance um, and uh, and gave us their donation form that they use, which Karen then um, used to draft a donation form for us along the same lines, but obviously more the fitting of the house. Um, so yeah, just kind of making sure that we have all of our bases covered so that we can uh, objectively accept or deny donations and give people potentially other options and yeah, good so idea. yeah so we'll have that I, I think we should be able to have that the next one for and then I just want to compliment yeah. Brittany and Karen and everybody yeah. that's been on this Brittany's done for serious we are thank you so thank you basically lucky to have her on the yeah. board yeah and, and um, yeah it's just a lot of work on this it's, it's pretty amazing and this is this thank, is great. You. <laughs> thank you Karen and Cindy and Martin for really talking with it so yeah we're excited to have that. I think it'll be really useful. Yeah, we needed that. It's yeah. good thing. Okay. Um, anything else? No. Okay. Next is Art Walk, and there was a we had a little committee on that, and we had one meeting, and I'll let everybody talk. But um, to start with, uh, we did get our fees paid, so we'll, we'll be in the advertising with uh, the Art Walk people, and we had a meeting and kind of divided things up, and um, it's going to be fun this year. It's going to be different. And it's going to be fun. So uh, we've got some artists for in the house already. Uh, we've got some outside, outside stuff that's yes. going to be fun. Um, Marine, uh, you can talk on the music. Speak mm -hmm. of that. And Brittany, you found us a, uh, I almost said live painter. I did a live painting. <laughs> All of our painters are live. <laughs> <laughs> we haven't killed any. We have <laughs> the body. Posthumously. So, <laughs> <laughs> oh, we haven't jumped into AI yet with right. our artists. Yeah. But it will be outside. We'll have to kind of find a spot. I was even thinking of the portico there. Sure. Yeah. Because if it is a little drizzly yeah. out then we can spot. Or the porch. Well, well, so. well, yeah. yeah. Yeah, we'll have to figure that out. <laughs> so, um, like we're inside, we've got a photographer, we've got the uh, Red Door is going to be in here with her. She's a smattering, like, kind of a consignment artist, so there'll be a sampling of all different artists in this room. Um, who wants to go first? Okay. Go ahead. Um, I have um, Sal um, Monterano. He's um, a local resident that has been in town for forever and a teacher. Mm -hmm. He was a band instructor over at um, Lawns Peak, and he is bringing his trio, and he's very excited um, to, to play for us on the porch, and he's already been over the porch measuring what everything. Play? Um, he plays jazz and, and all sorts of stuff. Oh, he's, a, he's an amazing, very amazing um, gentleman, um, very enthusiastic. He's very excited about doing it. And um, I said that we would do a nominal donation of $500 to the group, and that. They were like, yeah. He's also very involved with the Long Lock Symphony, and, um, and they just did their big um, garden fundraiser. Now, will they, can they do the whole four hours? Or will they, yes, they he, a break he, he, he did say he is no longer 20 and he will leave a break. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, what? It's <laughs> a <laughs> bathroom <laughs> break? No. So, yes, yeah. And, and, I, and they're usually on the back side there, so they, yes, they see right. our yeah. the garden. So, yeah. But he is very excited about doing it, and I think we'll be lucky to do that. The other thing that was on my on my plate was I'm going to try to talk to um, Tim King about uh, doing um, a uh, more of an instructional thing about his um, bronze work. And I don't know if you, anybody's familiar with Tim King. He has done a lot of the, if you've ever been to the elementary schools um, and see the, the um, 
the bronze pieces of the children reading books or anything like that. Mm -hmm. He's got several pieces around town. He's an amazing artist, and he is. A, so, okay, and that's in the works. Yeah. It's in the works. Okay. I'm still working on that one. But we'll, so you we'll, do the ones at Roosevelt Park. Yes. Great. Oh, that was that's great. Wow. Fun. So, yeah. And he would be outside too. Yeah, we had talked about placing him in front of the. Um, the auto house. And That's true. Right there. That. Or it depends on the weather. Yeah, or if the live painting is on the porch, you can maybe under the portico where it's protected a little bit. Yeah, yeah we'll, we'll, we'll yeah. figure out the smattering of the we'll world and everybody. Yeah. But we'll I think to activate all those different spaces. I think it would be really nice. Yeah. Okay, great. You want to talk about painting. your live painting? Oh, yeah. Painting? Um, so his name is John Aaron. He's been painting um, out of Boulder for several decades. Um, <laughs> yeah, he's been around for a long time. <laughs> um, but he's wonderful. He's a vendor that I work with at Chautauqua. Um, and he does a lot of work with the old Victorians in, you know, downtown Boulder. So I thought that that was a really great fit. And he loves to come and talk to people about his work. And um, he'll, you know, I'm, I'm not sure. We're trying to work out if he can maybe come and do something ahead of time to get a an image of the house started so then that he can be working on it while wow. he's here. But oh, um, yeah, so I don't know if that'll be able to happen or not, but either way, the subject matter will be appropriate. And, oh, and great name book artist. Artist. So, John Aaron, A A R O N. So yeah, that'll be fun. And he can be really interesting. He's happy to be outside. He does a lot of like plein air painting all over the place all the time. So it's if I'm used to that. And, um, yeah, so that'll be great. And I'm also working on trying to help fill those last couple oh, tables in the house. So well, you have I've one had a couple of those, but yeah. Yeah. Uh, yes, yeah, still waiting to hear back from a local watercolorist. But and I've got some other names too. Great. So yeah. Yeah. And again, we can throw it out to the board. If you we do yeah. have two spots in the house yet. So if you know somebody, please throw it out to us and we can help. Okay. Yeah. And who was it you talked about here in the dining room? Um her, her name's Elaine. I think, but anyhow, she runs the red door and she has a consign it's like a consignment place for artists. And so, what she does is bring a sampling of about 10 different artists, and it, it's nice, you know, because you get a lot of different things, right? Mm -hmm. That's nice. She's out of line, it's all right. Hygiene, right off yes, of, of um, on the way, so yeah, it used to be right next to the um. Crane Hollow or Crane yeah, but that closed. Right. Oh, yeah. they're, they're, oh they're, that they, they did close nice that. They think they're yeah, open. They're exactly. reopening and yes. then but you see what they did for the gas station out there. The new, the new little gas station they made oh, this yes. incredible, amazing coffee shop. Oh, awesome. I was hoping that would be something like but that they someday. Really, it, it just oh. has opened and it looks just amazing. It's pretty That's upscale, fun. isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Pretty yeah. bougie. Yeah. yeah. So, so you're open to having a couple more if and you we only have two spots, but one is it's ten I'm ready to take the cake. So I'm supposed to say one Maybe spot. one more. Okay. And Anne's and, guidance was that we want different types yeah, of Yeah, so numbers. we've got a photographer, we've got uh, a sampling in here, which right. I everything. It'll be a watercolor, the tentative one is a watercolor, so we'll pick some, you know. If you, if you know somebody, let us know. Are, if not, we'll, are, are we still yeah, open to so. maybe having a jewelry artist? Jewelry is fine. We'll probably have a little jewelry here, but that's fine. That would be good in the parlor because that's a smaller room. So the yeah. jewelry doesn't need as much room. Okay, I have an artist that I can reach out to and see. Okay. Great. Yeah. Okay, and that's the one spot. Okay, and, then yeah. if the, and if the watercolor comes through, if not, yeah. we'll still oh, have to reach out to her again. Okay, so then we will. Okay. And, and this is early, too. So again, if somebody doesn't yes, work out, you know, don't panic. We sell them to somebody else. Great. <laughs> um, Alrighty, and so again, the date is uh, September 9th, 8 p.m. And I am telling the artists the usual that come here at three, three to mm -hmm. four is set up. Um, those three of us on the board, we'll have to divide up, you know, we divide up the board, but the three of us in the group will be in the first group because we want to be here when there are people we've talked to set yeah. up. Right. And then help them get things going. Yeah. Now something was mentioned um, about a contract. Do, do, do we need to have the music contract then for, for, the, for the musicians if we're just doing a nominal fee? I don't, I don't think we've I had a contract so. in the past, it, but I, I believe you are. Well, that's just something yeah. that we haven't done. We generally try to stick with what we've done in the past. I mean, it was just a 
We don't have to have a contract for somebody to do what they normally do. Like I can pay somebody to come in and move the bales. No, I don't have a contract for that. That's just what yeah. we do. Okay. I, I understand if we were paying a large sum or something along those yeah, lines. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. If we you know. It would seem silly. It, it, it would, would seem silly, silly but yeah. yeah. The, and, and sometimes our contracts do seem silly. And, and yeah. The, these little tiny ones that end up going all the way through the system. But, but I. Okay. I just, just wanted to verify. I think it's oh. under the threshold of when you have to provide someone with a 1099. <laughs> no, I think someone would state that in a letter. So, so, so I, think, I think it's fine. Yeah. One more thing to reiterate, if somebody is getting a, another vendor by chance that um, there's no table fee, which is a really big seller, yeah, most of the time people mm -hmm. have oh. some kind of table fee, oh. and we are um, mm -hmm. on the map, too. So right, we yeah. paid for the advertising, so yeah. we're on the advertisement. Yes. Um, yeah, so just ask them to, don't promise that, because you know we might have already talked to somebody, but just throw it our way. Mm -hmm. Right, and yeah, let them deal with it. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay, so I think we have covered our law. Thanks for everybody for all your help. Thanks for you. So we are going to be fun. Oh, it's going to be yeah. different. Yeah. 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 Okay, should we move on to new business? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, news releases for grant project. Who wants to talk about that? I'm, I'm happy to draft um, something that then would, of course, be approved by the board. Um, but And then it would, of course, um, would that have to go through legal before it goes to the newspaper, or no? Maybe? Just start through us. Okay. We'd be coming from the city. Okay. But, but right, your timing wise, if you. I mean, it's a newspaper. Technically, no. Everybody can talk to the newspaper in right. their lives, and that's totally, right. totally fine. But if it's, if it's something that's coming from you guys, representing us. Yes. Yeah. Um. So honestly, I think that'd be amazing, Karen, if we did that, and then we approved of it at the next meeting, and then put it in place if you're saying in my mind I'm thinking is the concrete work you think gonna be completed by August? Well by the end of August. That's the, the six weeks between mid July and the end of August. Yes. So that would be perfect. Yeah. So the timing is nice. Timing wise yeah. it would be perfect and people so if people come by and see something's going on. You, then, yeah, so yeah. you imagine something going out again then mid-July as we restart and really the visual stuff's all going to be in the next six weeks. So. Well I was thinking that in August 1st type of thing if we, we would put it out in the, in the first August. And then August. of course when we're done. Yeah. yeah. Okay. The project. Yeah, that's great. Cool. Are you willing to do that then? Um, yes, yes I'm, I'm happy to great. grab something Thank for you. the board's review and approval. Um, as my apologies but I want to jump back to Art Walk just for a second. Um, we didn't discuss the upstairs room, which will be open um, during our walk. And now normally, and I think we'll do that again this year, is we play a video, you know, and it's a nice historical video. But we also have this big room up there, so we can kind of condense that a little more into the east side. Mm -hmm. And then, Karen, you wanted to set up a table, I think, for the present, for the um, a grant, if you want to. Uh, well, I would prefer that be in the library. And well, the reasons, well, but the reasons, the hope would be Actually, look at the windows. Well, they can. I, I that one in particular. Artist, but I would I, like to. Art walk is for the artists. It, it, it is. is. I it would is. like that's the primary purpose. Yes, yeah, so that's why we offer them a room. It is, but we discussed that that would be like our unveiling of projects and the grant work. So cool. that's cool. why I suggested. And would, I, I remember you brought it up. It was, that, it was just brought up. Yeah. But it, well, wasn't it discussed that we could? Label that this is the window, and then we would do most of the historic stuff upstairs. Yeah, maybe just put a little eight by ten mm -hmm. little table, you know, a framed on a little what do you call it? A little tripod. 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 Yeah. There. This is a little tripod, not a big tripod. And in the library. In there, but not have, but really, because an artist is going to have that room. We. That's why we're doing this. That's what we offer them a room is so they can show their stuff. Would it be possible to do anything like that for the summer open house? Uh, no, it would be more ongoing, but uh, we just could try. Just throw it out. We could uh, try. Just the visuals won't be. Yeah, the visuals. I was going to say, I don't know that we're going to be there yet. Yeah. 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 Okay. All right. Just throw it out Put a marker, but then put the details upstairs. You can have a whole table yeah. upstairs. Yeah. Yeah. And maybe well, you can maybe take a picture of it. I think we put a marker, and I, I, I think we 
Can we, can we make it, I guess, the marker so that it holds the space of the curved window? In other words, so the artist is not set in that area, yeah, but more that. set. I'm sure we can put I the artist I think we could do that, and then we have more in-depth information upstairs. Right. Because what we had talked about doing upstairs is we had talked about having the film and then having the you, items that were for purchase. For, yeah, yeah, the, the, the items for purchase art. right there, mm -hmm. and, 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 and you with the discussion, and then we had talked about having historic um, clothing in the bride's oh, room. And um, I, I had that contact that you met, the young gentleman that had um, menswear from, from right. the 1900s. Right. Right. So I'm working on having him, as well as um, possibly women uh, clothing uh, to, to, in, in the bride's area. Um, so if anybody happens to have a 1910 or so wedding dress, if you happen to have one, just have one. Have one. Have you been to Masonville to the store up there? They've got store. I guess I have. Right, I've heard about it. Um, this gentleman that I spoke to, no, to, I agree. Period wedding dress. But as far as women's clothing is concerned, that's mm -hmm. something to think about because I. But I had just been to a uh, luncheon with my questers group, and we had this group come in and do all the undergarments for women's wear going all over. And it was really fascinating. She had several dresses and I was going to reach out to her oh, to see if she could put something in place. Um, if enough. not, I also have the historic um, Colorado, um, I have the card, um, costume guild that I was gonna contact. Oh, great. So, so I'm, go I'm working on stuff. Okay, I don't know that's a hard thing to come by. You it know, is, it is. You know, relevant or not, but a friend of mine just showed me recently a whole collection of vintage purses, some of them beaded and so on, really, really old, old stuff. And her sister-in-law had collected it and then the sister-in-law passed away. I don't know if you'd be interested in looking at this box of purses to see if there's anything you'd want to display with the women's clothing. Truthfully, being with my, with my questers group, I know people that collect purses I have. Um, I would be fascinatingly interested. That might be an interesting process. table to set up. Yeah. I have. I have. A you of, have some. Well, I right? have. I have some, but I collect them. It's my passion. Yeah. That and hats. So, so uh, you're talking to the right person here. Yeah. 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 It would be an interesting right table well, to set up up there. Yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, wonderful. what should I tell her that it's possible? Yeah. Some that might be on this In the guest room. In the guest room. Yeah. 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 In the guest room, we, we could discuss the guest room what was the best the table for us. Right. Right. Okay. But it's not something that we want to keep as a Yeah, <laughs> it's a bright room. But if she's interested in making it, um, disposing of the collection, we have to be I can't. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's up to her. It. I don't know where she's at. Yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't think so. I just want to make sure we're talking about the same thing. she did, we're going to be in the now. Oh, absolutely. Okay, I'll mention it to her. But that's what clothing. I don't know if she would be nice to get rid of it, but. I guess if she was getting paid, maybe she'd pay twice. Yeah. yeah, but 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 that's along those lines. That's something to discuss. That maybe at some of our open houses, I run into some amazing people here in Longmont. Um, I'm blanking on the last name. Her name's Anne, and I cannot remember her last name. But she is responsible for doing historic quilts. She has over a thousand historic quilts here in town oh, yeah. that date, some date pre-Civil War. Jean Anne, right? Wow. Jean Anne, right, that's it. Yeah, Jean Anne, right. Jean Anne, I'm sorry. Wow. Uh, I'm one of Anne. And, um, Jean Anne, right, and she's an amazing lady. Um, she has done restoration for, for all sorts of stuff. Yeah, really it's just astounding what she's got. And that, but maybe that would be something that we might consider doing at an open house at some point where we would bring in specific mm -hmm. guests that don't necessarily want to sell items, but that would like to display items right, and right. talk historically. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. just what we know. I think that's, that's right. a good idea. <coughs> I like just fundraising. Yes. Yes, thank you, and thank you for just mm -hmm. So in wrapping that up, Swiss cheesy. the clothing part of the art is going to be in what was formerly known as the bride's room, now known as the guest room, mm -hmm. and in the yeah. meeting room, we'll have on each side the Video. DVD playing and the um, house items for sale, such as the books and the artwork. artwork. 
on the east right. side of the meeting room, and on the west side, we can have a table for the grant project mm -hmm. one. Okay. And as and we set it up, we can tweak it. You know, right. one thing would work better somewhere else. But, we'll, but that's a good that's a good starting plan. That's and, a good outline. Yeah, and we'll have a marker, as you call it, um, near the curved glass table right. down here. Mm -hmm. Can that be on one of the short square tables so that it is then um, on a, just a, a tabletop easel that shows, and it's just in front of the window so that, in essence, it kind of directs people to, to where to look, and then you know they're seeing the easel with the information about the window, and then yeah. they're looking right there, and the window's right there. Right. I, I don't want to... I mean, we will do something there, but I don't want to promise a whole table because, again, we, we did promise that room to an artist. And but she's not talking to an artist. No, no, one of the small card small. tables. Yeah, 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 we it's usually small. give the artist sure. like two card tables. Well, it's, it's about, a like small board thing or upright table. Or, or yeah, something board on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah it takes up less room. Right. But but something that's yeah. Well, I think yeah, so we'll do something that works. Right in front of it so that it's not right in front of the window so it's not taking up too much room. Right. I think. Just saying that when we set up, Brittany, Ann, and I will be here, and Karen, if you come, and then we'll we'll just make a decision on what what goes away, well, what works, and I think we're all adults yeah, that, that think we can do something. We'll make some nice. It'll, yeah. it'll be nice. It'll, it'll be work. nice. Okay, so that stuff will yeah. You know, so we'll tweak it as we go along. We'll talk about that. Okay, sorry for. Jumping back there, but no, no, no. remember these guys. Okay, where where are we now? I don't okay, know. Okay, so we already talked about the news release. Karen is going to write us a great little article, and the default T is um, B six B. So we need to start looking at a date for that. Uh, uh, may I suggest that we do something in early October? Um, yeah. It's indoors, so we don't worry about the weather too much. Right? Well, and if we're lucky, not going, on, maybe the garden, we might still have a little smattering of the gardens. In October, it's yeah. freezing. Yeah, well, it's usually the end of October is when things, yeah, yeah, you know, the weather starts to come. So we, we might get lucky there. Get together for past and present board members, managers. This is that get together. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you. Yeah, it's a tea yeah. unit. Um. So, do so we usually fund that or? Do you, does do the supplies get sponsored, or I think the Callahan House funded him. We it, it's we've tried to keep it um, minimal it's cost. Low key. It's pretty low key. It's more about getting together and visiting and, and sharing and updates sharing about the house. Yeah. And, okay. yeah. and by October, we should have good things to everybody show everything and all the mm -hmm. things that we've done. I would hope. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, do we have a budget? Sure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I honestly don't. Know. I don't know. I haven't seen it. Well, we're not going to go to town. The, the stuff we've done, we can certainly do it. I was going to say, we can look back at the costs that were on the financial reports from um, years prior. Right. And, and it's going to be something very similar in line with that. Very right. minimal. Well, we, right. We've had pastries brought in. For yeah, we had a little cheese and meat. And, cheese and, and, and um, yeah. I believe... Um, Jacqueline was responsible for all of that. Um, we can we can certainly. I know that I could pitch in and make some pastries or desserts or whatever. Yeah, so we can do that as a donation. And then we do have cheese and, and things in case people have dietary issues. Can you share that? Yeah, it's not really a meal. Yeah, it's yeah, it's not really the afternoon. I don't right. like a whole bunch of sugar. No, I no. Know. I'd rather have cheese or cheese, cheese, cheese and, and, and fruit yeah. or something. Savory. Well, maybe yeah. we could do a, a, some small tea sandwiches. Something. Yeah, but it should be small. tea. Yeah, that's nice. Is that usually I on a weekend or a weekend? We usually have it on a Sunday. We normally have it on a Sunday. 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 So you've got the 1st, 8th, and 15th. They're all Sunday. Selfishly, I mean, and I don't know. Okay, that's okay, fine because uh, Columbus Day is the ninth, and that we wouldn't want to like interfere so with anyone's other plans for a holiday. Or I, think I, I can't make it the fifteenth. Can, can, can we try the first? Can we try the first? It's my mom's birthday. I don't oh, know. Oh, oh, we could oh, probably oh. do something on Saturday. Well, October. Let's see what she comes. October twenty second. Yeah, that's there. You go. Twenty second is still on our guests. Let's look at the twenty second. How's everyone for the twenty second? Weather could be getting bad, but yeah. 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 But we're inside. Yeah. Keep in mind, it's yeah. always registered. Come in. I could get together with her on Saturday. 
Yeah, we get back from a women's retreat that day. We also have the 29th. I'm sure it has spies. That might be Christian and a little cold. <laughs> well, we don't, the, I mean, I wouldn't use the weather as an indicator because no, we, we, have no control. we have no control. We're going to be on the control. Are you is okay? Or? Oh, all right. Well, I think the first is Please. okay. I can. Mm -hmm. I don't want you to do that with so you. It's only on But Yeah, I think the first is fine. Are you sure? Yeah. We'll see her on Saturday or I'll see her after. Yeah, we can always adjust that. We don't have to put it in concrete yet. Yeah. So well, what the bigger yeah. expenses was the um, invitations that we sent out? No expense yeah. there. No, it, it was. Um, it was there are supplies that we already have here at the house. Yeah, the kind of was easy. Well, she John. That was minimal. That was all right. Um, we didn't send out what twenty, maybe thirty. I think it was like yeah. thirty. Yeah. Like 30 yeah. I think it was minimal. thirty, and we actually used had stamps that were. Oh, we had things. Okay, yes. all right. She didn't want that to go. Yes. So. Yes. No, well, it's, it's yeah, there's the other thing is we could go Target the for, first. Okay. or we could go for, um, just so why did we like the eighth? I like the first. If we could oh, do uh, the first. Candy's not available on the eighth. Oh, they, yeah. I, don't find you. I just didn't hear it. You need to be here. Yeah. You're about Yes. I'm just the last one, so. Yeah. Wait, so that that is, and I'm just the last one because I had COVID. That's what you did. Your mom is here. Your mother-in-law is here. Right. So October 1st, how about the, the time that we've done in the past has been a afternoon, kind of mid-afternoon. I think we had two plots that are yeah. traditional. I think it typically has been a little bit. I think that would be perfect because it's it, two, two o'clock for people that have vision issues elderly people on the board or whatever mm -hmm. else right. don't want to be driving out in the dark mm -hmm. and I think we, it, we need to look broadly so you know one or two is good and then everybody's mm -hmm. kind of one's fine too one or two, two. if we go at two and then we can be here at one to set up I think that works yeah because some people on Sundays have you know church services well we don't, we don't want any people yeah so you don't want to take the morning you know mm -hmm. but, um, Brittany, thank you for being such a nice to do that. Hey, Mama could come, you know. She would love that. <laughs> Why don't you bring Mama? I can do that too. Yeah. I mean, really, a cup of tea, a couple of sandwiches, that would be nice. There's room in the gym that she would love it. Yes. <laughs> Nobody yeah. wants it. She'd, she'd, yeah, she'd be welcome. She'd be more than welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, it's generally a two hour. Um, Event. So if it is, and we have done one to three and, and also two to four. So what do you all want to do? One, one to three? Yeah, it's fine too. Yeah, that one's one better. Yeah, let's do one. Is that what you were thinking, okay. Karen? The other Karen? Yeah. I'm looking at you, but you're right. not looking. Yes, that's what I was thinking. So I mean, two shouldn't sit next to each other. Right, exactly. <laughs> one, one, one to three? Yeah. October. <laughs> so one to about three, yeah. I the first. And we'll check the calendar. Okay. Yeah. I assume it's fine. Yeah, hopefully there's no wedding ready. And then can you send that out to everybody? Sue Ellen normally does that. I saw you. I'll right. figure out a way. I'm on sort of. Yeah, we'll find out. <laughs> find a way. Okay. So Let's get it on our big calendar. Is set for the October 1st at 1 p.m. Okay. Uh, moving on to. Um, do we need to set up? Uh, I am just, do we need to set up a, a committee to work on it? Yeah. Yeah, I suppose we should. Um, any volunteers? <laughs> can work on it. Course. I work on it. Yeah, I think we worked on it. We yes. worked on it last yeah. year. Yeah. Okay. Cindy, did you want to be part of it as well? Yes. Yeah. If yes. you need oh, yes. help, you should. You should. There is really no too many. No, the more the merrier. Really. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. So, okay. so yeah. it would be great. One more voice always has a better suggestion than the other yeah. person. <laughs> well, and of course, well, it's, it's always good to get more people involved and included exactly. yes. in all of these okay. annual plans. Well, once you have a plan, then I say all of us should be involved. Oh yes, oh yeah, oh, absolutely. Right. The, yeah. The, the the point is just to get together and talk about them, and then yeah, of course bring it back to the yeah. board and say, okay, so here's what we're thinking. What do you think? Any yeah. other input or suggestion? Or, it's always that way. And you guys can set up a side meeting. Yeah, yeah. 
Okay. Sounds good. I apologize. Oh, well. but I will be. Okay. I'll reach out to you to set us up okay. for beautiful for okay. meeting. Alrighty, and then number C, now we move the July 26th open house down to spot C here, so we can discuss that. Um, the timing of it, will that be, or is that made it later? Because the other one was rather poorly attended. Yeah. Well, again, it's, it, I think that if we have more than just an hour and a half, that might be a good idea. But more importantly, getting the word out is, in, is really critical. And it was in two different weeks yeah, of costume contact. However... My only, my only criticism of that is this: it was really low down on the list. I mean, when you when you pull up the Thursday constant contact, the, you have to dig for it. You there's a, a nice, beautiful list of lots of things to do in recreation, which is fantastic. But it was pretty far down, and and given that it was coming up sooner than other events, mm. I I thought it maybe should have been a little higher up on the list. That's just a thing that I, I think if, if something's coming up within two weeks, it probably should be one of the top items um, on the rec list. Um, but aside okay. from that, um, sending out an email to the, the guests who we did have sign our guest book uh, and, and say, hey, this is coming up, you know, that, that's a big thing. So, so were we looking at changing times? I, it's up to you all. I, I think the, the time yeah, kind of time. interferes a little bit, if, if we can extend it a little bit, I guess is what I would say. Because it was a, what were we, four? It was like four to six. To six? Oh, oh that was four to five thirty. I think it was four, four to five thirty. I think it was an hour. That's think it was really just, bad. It's a small window, and it's business hours. There's that are working, there's no way. Most people don't even get off till five. Why don't we get four thirty to six thirty? I'm thinking that's maybe a good idea. Or, or, or I don't want to commit too much of your guys' time. That's a, that's adding another half hour. And can, can, can we make minutes. it more like five to seven? That's that's a better. I I, 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 think. Think. Yeah. I honestly think we're, we're working five with seven. people that are working. Yeah, yeah it is hard. Yeah, to get home from work and you also you have to come right away. So and if people bring kids, it's the young adults who are working who yeah. have those kids. If you want to educate. And that's and we're to educate that. the younger mm -hmm. population. Yeah. That's something about getting more people involved. And more, the more, I don't know anybody that doesn't work. Yeah. And I can't get get there, so. right, except for people that are retired or have mm -hmm. issues. I mean, for the most part, it's. So can we get an agreement five to seven? They agree? Yes. Do we have a vote or can we just get a verbal? Let's get a vote. Okay. Yes, I think we're all okay. Let's okay. like we all kind of five, five to seven. Five to seven. And we'll see what we're doing here. On July 26th. Oh, Michigan. You see it. Okay. So, so then, <laughs> since it's not Art Walk, since it's nothing, so we can get by with a smaller crew. Right. So yeah. um, Now, is there anything else? Is it just going to be an open house? Is it going to be anything else? Or do you want to show your, you know, any more of the uh, grant? Do you want any more of those things around? Really well, the what's, part of it right what I could put together is just informative sure. boards. Sure. I mean, if you want, say, you want this, is, yeah. yes, yes. Yeah, for sure. But this is what the project. Yeah, this is where we are. Now. Here's why there's yeah. something going on out there. Or excuse our mess. Yeah, yeah. 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 excuse, excuse our mess. Right. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it gives um, a. Sure, absolutely. I think we should say. Actually, that's all attention. I mean, July is about the house. Twenty-six. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. And can we have that put in our board calendars then, please? Um, so that comes out and it shows up on everybody's. Oh, <laughs> I keep jumping around here. I'm sorry. Um, Jumping one more thing back to our walk. Some we've always had tables set up outside. And oh yeah. Is the city will the house take care of that or will the city crews take care of that? Um, yeah, I'm I, not sure how we've done it in the past, but I'm sure whatever. It was well, done, Kathy and Kathy's husband used to do it. Yeah, <laughs> used to, she used to get people. What sort of tables and what were they? The square card tables and put a little sometimes a little. Uh, Tablecloth on them. It was for people in chairs for people just to sit out there. The band would be playing so they could sit and listen. They sit and listen. Yeah. I'm sure we can figure it out. I think, think sure Jacqueline and Betsy can handle that. Okay, we just, so we have it down so somebody's assigned to it. So at least, very confident. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And okay. then we'll, if, that's a good question. Do you need one of us? I don't us know to that that's something we need the, the material or if we could use just the really 
little bit longer table. Anyway, we'll figure yeah, out. Yeah, we just kind of we'll scatter, but we never, the board has never messed with that. That was always no, staff. Staff. Yeah. Staff. Yeah. staff. Yeah, that was our yeah. Do you need us to speak to staff to do that then, or we yeah. have a lot there? Okay. Thank okay. You. Just wanted to make sure we got that. Sorry, I keep Yeah, let's back talk there. about those setup things again in August and yeah. make sure we're going to have a plan. Okay, okay. I'm going to try to figure it out before that. Yeah. I hate to interrupt again, but um, with the faulty, we should make sure that's on the staff's schedule as well, that they know that we're having the team. Yes, oh, yeah. oh, okay. yep. I'll, I'll make sure this goes to okay. the proper place. place. <laughs> yeah. Okay, again, jumping around here a little bit. Okay, so um, we covered the fall tee, uh, number seven. Are we done with the tee? Anything else you want to cover? Okay, let's listen to the summer open house that we were just <laughs> on. We're, 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 we're just talking. Right. <laughs> we're going to get everything covered, and it's good. So, okay, so, we, <laughs> so with our summer open house, and we, we said, okay, it's going to be five to seven. Um, again, that's a, a every, we all need to be here and present. You know, 15 yeah, minutes before right, right. Hand. Oh, yes. right. And, and, yeah, 15 minutes beforehand, and then have our little special space. Mm -hmm. And yeah, then, like, um, they're in the drawer. They are. Yeah, so but, I made folders as can be suggested, but, and that was an excellent well, suggestion. On that suggestion, do we have name picks for our new board members? Yeah, yeah. yeah. We had yeah. Last they, time, were, right? they were here. Yeah, for yeah. Your, yeah. Last, last time. So, okay, great. Right. Okay, good. And uh, since it's July 26th, which is nice, we'll have a, our July meeting. Yes. Well, I, yes. Yeah. I just wanted to nail down all this yeah. stuff. Yeah. Sorry. Okay. So. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, anything else? Nope. Okay. Let's move on to items from staff. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 Yeah. Moving into a slightly adjusted role, uh, it's a promotion for her. Oh, good. Um, good. Doing much of the same thing that we have to have her do, or we crumble at the seams. Um, we're just taking care of our backside of all of our, our track and all of that. Uh, just fun stuff that she loves and, and drives me insane. Um, so she's going to be area supervisor for us, which is great uh, in our what we'll call business business services section. And um, we will be hiring a uh, program supervisor that was her current position. We're going to change that position. That person will actually end up overseeing Callahan House. So they'll, they'll oversee um, special events, general interest, Callahan House, Sandstone, rentals. Wow. Um, so, job. Job but there's a person in each of those jobs. Oh, okay. So, oh, but that person's um, supervising. There are, yeah, yeah, that person's going to supervise. So, so we're going to not see Sue Ellen anymore. You, yeah, I'm going to have to move her out of here. I think you'll see me, um, and and probably oh, this nice. this new person too. <laughs> but we'll you know we'll figure that out. There's a, there's a ways to go on that. Um, so you'll see her for a while well, still for sure. Well, congratulations um, to her promotion. Yes. She, it's it's very well, well deserved. Her. So that dovetails into the, the amazing news that we will have somebody around for July 26th and somebody after the July 12th board meeting will have to resign from the board. So I'd like you to welcome our new house manager. Oh! So yeah, you're fired from here. But. Fired. <laughs> fired. Retired. Is Retired is much better. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Retiring. oh right. congratulations. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. congratulations. Promotion. I'm so excited. <laughs> I used to fight for it. Yeah. <laughs> Good for you. We, uh, 
that we actually had yeah. some great candidates, which you know was this is not an easy position no, to fill, not. and we were really impressed. And Brittany's just amazing, and she was obviously a target, right? You know, just straight away, and could not be happier from our end. Welcome. Yes. I haven't actually Thank seen you, you since yeah. talking on the phone. <laughs> talking on the phone a lot. Hey. Um, so we're, we could not be more excited to get her going. That's wonderful. Thank you. Great. Yeah. Really excited to get her going. And so for sure, <laughs> she always had that involved chair. in <laughs> helping her to get started on the lot of behind the scenes stuff that, that I, I haven't involved myself with. So, so we'll see a lot of Sue and Brittany Law. So, yes. um, just. Just couldn't be more excited. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I knew you guys would be excited. So. Yeah, absolutely. You have this beautiful, Such great historic story. background, and thank you. It's your perfect fit. Oh, she said it. Well, that is a really good news. Yes. Yeah. 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 I don't, yes, that. I don't have anything else. Okay, no meeting. Yes. So, so, <laughs> so, but we don't know who that interim person is. The other face, yeah. We still oh have. no, that's that's yeah. The program supervisor will be. Um, that, that job will be posted externally. Okay. Um, we do have a couple good internal candidates for it, but um, we'll definitely post that one externally. And that's the job. I'm excited to have Phil because I'm doing that. <laughs> yeah. He wants a break. The rest of it. Yeah. You'd like to be doing you, one you job. You want to wear two multiple hats? It's been over a year. and I'm. It's time. <laughs> And it's time. So it's time to retire that one hat. Yeah, I don't yeah, and I need to. I need to be able to get out more to the recreation center and, and mm -hmm. aquatics and some different areas that I haven't been well, able to that's do good. So um, definitely excited for me. But also this, I think it's really cool. This position, the way we're kind of mini reorganized, it, it really allows this person. We haven't had this sort of position even when I was area supervisor spread quite a bit more thin, this person's going to be able to really to focus on on those areas in programming and assist, again, there, there's a person who's there, there's Sam in, in events, and there's Kristen in the general programming, and you know, Brittany here, um, and Rochelle in our rentals, and, and it's, and Ariana in our therapeutic, our new person, therapeutic preparation, so they can, their only job is to help them, and God knows I have new do that. I'm thankful that we just have these amazing people that take yeah. care of themselves. But with some help, they can really continue to grow. So it's, it's really an exciting time for us. And wow. Yes, this is a big score. Yeah. 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 That's great. Yeah. That's probably going to be happier. Thank you. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm rethinking. So then that opens up more position. How are we going to handle that? It would get refilled in, in, in December. Yeah, we'll just in fill December. Like, we, yeah. We've been shorthanded before. Yeah, yeah. Well, last year. We too, we were too short. Yeah. yeah, we were short. Yeah. short. You have the yeah. potential of the. But 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 basically, it stays open until we go through the whole process. That's right? been the process as far as yeah. I understand. Yeah. How does the funding work then? Since you won't have a quorum, well, hopefully we'll. Well, there's well, we have a well, quorum. Quorum. Well, quorum changes. Yeah. We do have the quorum. Yeah. yeah. If we have a tie, we have to talk more and negotiate. Yeah. I see. Right. Right. Be like Congress. Right. <laughs> yeah. No, no. We, we will be better. Oh, way better. <laughs> yeah. I think it's better, but we have to negotiate. Yeah. Tell everyone. Yeah. yeah. Tell everybody. Yeah. 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 We're going to be better than that. Yeah. yeah. We're not too many contentious. No. Yeah. 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 We're usually pretty good. Free free thing. So. Okay. That was the only item from staff. This needs to be walking towards. So. We have one more item on here. It's items from the board. Does anybody have any little tidbits to share? I knew you would. <laughs> oh, of course. I always love sharing. So, I so well, part of it is, is follow up from last meeting. Last month's meeting. Let me hit them this way. But, and, and, um, so take one and, and pass along. This is just a little bit of um, a proposed language for an email to go to the guests. Um, who have signed the guest book, and anyone else who has reached out for information about future um, things that are coming up at the house. But right off the bat, of course, we need to change the summer open house um, time from 4.30 to 6.30 to 5 to 7. So go ahead and strike that and, and re replace that with a 5 to 7 time frame. But um, I did want to um, 
run this by you all and see, is this acceptable to you um, for Sue Ellen or who, whoever is going to be doing that just proper email from the city to our guests. Who will the, um, the, the email be coming from? Will it say City of Longmont or will it say from, you know, the from, because... It's a good question. I was going to ask you all that. Yeah. Would, you, would you like it to say... Um, since or the subject from, line. The, from the Callahan House Advisory Board, or, yeah. or what? What would you all like? I wanted to let you all. Well, if anybody's email is like my email box, I just get so much stuff that I need something that catches my eye that I don't delete it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Because I get so much advertising, ads, 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 ads all the way down. So I just kind of go through, delete, delete. But if it's something catches my eye, then I skip over that one and I come back and read it. So this, I just want to something in the subject line that will catch their eye. Well, if this is going to the people that have signed up for our email, can we somehow have it? Well, here it says website at Longmont, Colorado, gov slash So it'll come from that, but... It come well, from it's going to come from, it'll come from a city. Yeah. yeah. A city. But, yeah. The that but I think the, the subject, the subject to me, you keep it Callahan this Callahan House events. Right. Or something that catches her eyes. Is that, that to me That's is what you see. See Callahan, which is immediately if you've done this. Right. Mm -hmm. You're going to almost sign up. Does that sound good? Callahan House events? Anything that, yeah, that catches your eyes. Okay, so. that's perfect. Callahan House so, events. That'd be so great. Subject should be Callahan House events. Okay. okay. And thank you for doing this, Karen. Yes. How, how does that read to you all? Is there anything you read to I think it reads change? really well. Yeah. It's simple and it gets the point. Yeah. Now, I did um, leave, um, refer to website for details on the Santa Open House because that's going to be a reservation required um, event. But the Holiday Open House is just refer, refer to the website for time because we've not yet carved out those times. And so, um, at this point, that seems appropriate to just refer them to. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. I just wanted to double check with you all and make sure that that's acceptable. So, I have a question. Did we at some point discuss wanting to collect donations? Um, the QR code was kind of designed for that. Mm -hmm. Is that built into this QR code? It is. Okay. Sure. Um, and when you scan it, uh, um, from from phone, the donation uh, option is at the top of the information page. Okay. Before so I had been at the bottom, you couldn't see it. Mm -hmm. So we requested they got there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. cool. so, um, yeah. so, yes, so I moved it up. So if you scan the yes. QR code, it's at the top of the information page that you donated. Okay, quite good. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, um, okay. items from the board. Um, okay. Are you done? Or do you have something else? Um, two quick things. Okay. So as long as this is okay, then um, should I just email the content to you? So I don't mess. To, 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 both both. to both of you. Okay. And then that I think you should send it to the whole board. Yeah. A copy you all. I think we should all see it. Yeah. It's the same content. Nothing's yeah. changing. It's just right. It's just, it's just yeah, this is. It's, now we all know what everybody else is seeing. Okay. Right. That's okay. So, um, and then the last couple of things, I got another article from Brian, who's doing that um, research. It's really kind of neat. Um, and I'll, I can email it to you, I'll just share it with you, but it's just this, um, is it Joe guy? Yeah, well, he's from Texas, but he's doing the, yeah, yeah, yeah. From, but he's doing the research for it. Um, but he found some article that um, from May 8th, 1936, that Tom Callahan had, um, gotten back to the city there and uh, informed them that there was this article in the Times Call here that he was receiving his 50 year um, jewel is what they call it for the um, odd fellows, the I O O F um, odd fraternity. Odd yeah. It's in the club at hey. Ashley's over on Main Street. Right. Yeah. So anyway, so he shared this with us too. So this can be included in the scrapbook, but I'm sure that it's nice. Um, and then I still need photos of the before, some before, before photos. Should I just follow up with an email to Sue Ellen and to you about that for the scrapbook? Okay. All right. I have a question on the scrapbook. Is anybody working on the digital 
Okay. How's that coming? Any, any, I can't say it. I'm going to. I'm going to ask you all if you would prefer to have it done by an amateur that we're not going to have any cost, or if you would like me to go ahead and get an estimate of what it would cost, like a per page, could we? Um, from from someone who does yeah. um, art photography, and it was referred to me by Eric Mason. Well, could we possibly see a sample of the free work? Okay. You know, so show us what you can do. And uh, it's not, it would not be, it would not be that professional, you, right? It, it would be me, or it would be a student who is. Why don't, why don't you do a sample for us? Okay. Just, not all of it, just a couple pages, so we can see what it would look like, sure. and maybe you'll get the job. I mean, what else? I'm not saying it's a job. I think it's so important that it be done right. Yeah. Um, and so it would be good too. So we can yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. All right. I will. Because if it's I'll bring that back. We're gonna go forget. Yeah. Because it could be exorbitantly. Yes. It could be. Yes. And we can have an example. Well, what we're to do is this. Right. Yeah. It is. It is exorbitantly priced or priced even moderately more than we what we normally choose. Then we can consider figuring out how the base wants to cover it. That's true. Yeah. So th there's right. there's ways to, yeah. Yeah. to do it. Yeah. <coughs> or, or if there are funds in the Calhoun House Fund that could be utilized toward it. Okay. Well, we can do both. It's Let, let's see what we're looking at. Yeah, so we're looking at. All right. I'll bring, all of those options. Okay. I'll sample. bring I'll bring um, so an estimate um, and a, a, some, a sample to next month's meeting. Sounds good. Or if you don't get it together by then. But yeah, we, that'd be great. That'd be wonderful. Okay, um, I, I have a, an issue that I wanted to bring up to the board. Um, my daughter, Molly, is a, she, is, she is doing um, several films and professional work on, that, on those lines. And um, she said that she'd be willing to come and work with us with her film crew and redo the video that we have of the calendar. It's, it's kind of dated. Um, I'm trying to be diplomatic. It's it's dated and, and I think that it you could use some work. Um, it, it's something for us to think about and to consider. Um, we could possibly get a grant for it to cover expenses, but she is her work was actually put up for a award this year. Um, at the grant was so and at the grant with the uh, Oscars. Just so you know, um, she, she's very good at what she does. But I thought it was very generous on her part. She said, "Would you consider collaborating?" Because I talked about the. She's heard me talk about the, the video being uh, needing to be updated and whatnot. And then, if that would be possible, that would be a consideration. If we redid our film work, then we could possibly consider working with PBS to have it put on. Um, that's a good idea. I think that's, yes, we should definitely do. consider that. The a video does cover, it's not just Callahan House, it's a long one. It's a long one history. She would include that. Yeah, um, and she is, you know, a native, and she is, she's yeah. also worked with, um, she's worked on various different boards and commissions herself. And she's, she, as a student, worked at, um, with uh, downtown development. So, authority, and uh, it just she's got a lot of amazing background in that. The, the, the fact that um, she's even willing to, to, to consider it, um, I think it's pretty amazing. And then you got um, yeah, Molly McCoy, M O L L I E. M -O -L -L -I -E. Um, but it's something I wanted to put out there. You know, I know other board members have heard me express that I think. We have an opportunity here to possibly get on the and, and use the films. I like watching PBS and, and watching the Colorado experience, and I think the Callahan would be a great fit. Yeah, we can't think for that. Mm -hmm. and, and if we could get something that was up to par, um, that they would be willing to look at, that would be crucial. Okay. Um, so she's yeah. going to do, we need to. I don't know. Think it's, it's something that we need to discuss as a board. As we're yeah. even open to, to 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 have a discussion, to have her come in and talk to the board, or, so, or I mean, it's up to you guys on whether this is something that you want to look at for now, or if we want to postpone it and look at it for an extra project. Again, um, the sooner we get on the 
the calendar to discuss things, it will take time. Yeah, it's going to take a long time to do it. And, right. uh, and, and whatnot, because she's got other projects that she's working on. Um, I, would, I would be in favor of getting her here to at least look it over and talk to us a little bit about it. I don't know when we could squeeze you know, yeah. in. Yeah. Well, like, could she be schedule. included in the agenda next month? Yeah, yeah. yeah. As an if, she she see, if, if she has it on her. Just kind of present to us yeah. her thoughts and when she, when she, 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 when she can. Yeah, so I will ask if she can present something to the board at the next meeting. Okay. And then so we can put her on the, uh, that would be the business. Or the yeah. 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 the yeah. 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 work, and I'll bring right. it, and I'll keep in contact with right. with Anne, and, 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 and what should be on the agenda, but but I wanted to put it out there. So yeah. July is the 12th, it should be available. I will ask yeah. if okay. that's what that works for her. the, what, the 9th? Um, she is working on other full projects. And then a quick side note um, for a community event that I did want to bring up. Um, I am working on a fundraiser um, this weekend at my father's house on 3000 Main, um, 3000 Mountain View. We're doing a Quester's Garage Sale, which is from, from across the state. And if you know about Quester's, we then any proceeds that we do um, go for historic preservation. So um, anybody that would be interested to come, it's going from eight until two o'clock. Um, please come and consider buying something thrifty, <laughs> or or uh, or not, uh, or not. Or spend some, a bunch, <laughs> spend some a dollar or so, and it all is for uh, a good cause. So. And that's this, this it's this seventeenth, um, seventeenth at three thousand Mount View, um, and it goes from eight until. Um, interesting. Is that going to be posted anywhere? It's, we're, it is posted um, on in the newspaper and, and again we've invited all the questers throughout the state. So, so, okay, so, so yeah. it, we're a national organization so we have, we've got latest coming from all the places. Great. All right. Fun. So any more items from the board? We've got a lot today. <laughs> um, okay let's move on to future agenda items then. Um, Let's see, the house manager picture project, that's pretty under control, but how's it be used? It's just waiting. It's kind Here's, of a holding pattern. Yeah, I was going to say collectively, um, that and the past and present board me member, um, um, well, art, is, is I mean, going to be happening at the same time. Right. And it really just comes down to when the wall, walls, um, when, walls when the hallway walls, because um, all of the photos that are on the walls right now, uh, in the hallway and uh, just outside the bathroom, need to come off. And then we're going to be looking Yeah, I'm meeting with Kevin next week just to talk about that. Okay. You know, I, I, don't, I don't just, here's what we want to do, here's what's here now. Any thoughts on, so, yes. Okay. So, so I'll have some more information on our next meeting. Okay, good. Do you, do you need volunteers to come and wrap the current? pictures that are on the wall and remove them and I, them. Not yet. Okay. Okay. So let so let me let me meet with him okay. and then I'm I'm reluctant to do much of anything as far as that stuff goes when we have orders coming through the house through the end of August. So but again as far as doing that work, let me I, I will know more. So at the next meeting we'll we'll set up we'll look to set up plan. I know it was discussed that um, we didn't want to hang anything until the work was done. But then there's the other aspect of we'll taking stuff down items. and taking care of it. Yes, so, yes, so yes absolutely. And that may need to get done that earlier. So that's right. we'll that's, just, we'll talk about that for sure. Okay, if, if we need volunteers, I guess. Mm -hmm. Since there's no work being happen happening over the next month, then it's fine. So we can talk we'll the next month for meeting yep. and say, okay, now we could probably go and be wrapping and something, tidying, mm -hmm. keeping it safe. But anyway, yeah, that is something that so that's we'll in process. Mm -hmm. Uh, moving on, the uh, club affair. That's going to be, we're going to schedule that next year, right? We still I have think to it's think something that we do want to consider to be scheduling for next year. So perhaps that might be something, not next month or <laughs> even the following month, it up. but potentially, you know, maybe, maybe not October. October. Okay. We might want to, let me, let's put that on the radar for, let's bring it up in October to talk yeah. about Yeah, remind me what that is. It, it's an event that is, um, an opportunity for clubs, uh, local clubs, to have a representative come and 
um, have a table here in the house and present um, information about their club. And um, then the house is open. Uh, it's kind of like our walk, but club walk, um, mm -hmm. because it allows the, the community to come in and walk See through all the house, but in the look at all the club opportunities. Yeah, we should call the it club walk. Club. <laughs> 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 I think club affairs. So I don't know who came up with the, the name. It actually we, you know, right? we did it three years, I think. And it was to drum up business for clubs to mm -hmm. use the house. Mm -hmm. but it was also a fundraiser because we charged them for tables. Mm -hmm. So if you wanted a small card table, it was X number of dollars. If you mm -hmm. wanted a larger table, it was X number of dollars. So mm -hmm. it was like no work on our part, basically, right. other than the setting up the tables and figuring out where you're going to put them all. Right. Um, it, it was, I felt, was successful. Mm -hmm. um, got a little crowded, a little hectic. Did you yes, have people upstairs? Yeah, upstairs. Yeah, all over. That's great. Um, That's what you want. But it was really pretty cool. Um, mm -hmm. so, yeah, you learned about the different groups and clubs right. that were in town and newcomers, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. you know, it worked pretty well. Yeah, so that's definitely something yeah. we can talk about in October, or unless somebody has some really good information prior to that. Mm -hmm. I no, I, I think it's a great idea, and I yeah. like the idea that we can use it as a fundraiser as well. It, and it not only. It was a community service yes. as well. Yes. 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 It introduced it new people, yes. and that was many several years ago. So we've got X number of. So was it advertised as like an open house? How was it advertised to get the public to come to it? Mm -hmm. I think we advertised in the paper. As, as club fair, it was called at club fair. Mm -hmm. Got it. Mm -hmm. yeah. And there were flyers. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah. Okay, to attract people to want, not just the clubs, but to. You have the general public coming to kind of. Oh, yeah, that's just it. Yeah. You wanted the general yeah. public. So, yeah, you first had to solicit the clubs yes. and yeah. get them on board. Yes. And then you had to guarantee that you were advertising to the community as well. Right, because I have to so say you were for a table. doing two different things. Right. Yeah. So, we could then put it in the newspaper, post it, mm -hmm. have a, a poster at the library, have uh, one at the senior center, various different oh, yeah. locations. But first, we started by brainstorming all the clubs we knew about in town. And then we sent to their presidents or whatever, sent flyers about it. Yeah. Then they had to respond by a certain date and with their money and stuff, so we knew what we had. And then we went about inviting them. Now, um, can we piggyback that on with the city? You know, events, sometimes we get better turnout from the public and yeah. piggyback. It seems like we do. Um, yeah, I, I don't know what's in. I don't know, that's kind of a standalone yeah. thing, kind of like the ice cream social. Well, you're not going to get. It's, yeah, there's no if, if, we're, if we're looking at some time early in the year, which I think is what we are. Yeah, there's nothing. Yeah. There's not, mm -hmm. once, we, once we get through Christmas, we're done. Yeah, you're done. Right, yeah. Out, so. okay. Okay. So so that, if you think about it, January, February, that's when people are thinking, about, right. I'm going to do something. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, yeah. it's yeah. typically been dark in February. So, 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 so February so. Is, is the key. And I think it was a whole morning. May have been a I remember. I'll double check the time, but I think yeah, I've got yeah. all my yeah, notes too. So. It's um, well, but it's a beautiful community service. Beautiful outreach, you know. I think it's a great idea. Yeah. And, yeah. and you know, informative about the house, but also about the local clubs and it's a little bit of a fundraiser. Yeah. I mean, it's win-win-win everywhere. Right. Figure out where to put people. Yeah. Yeah. How much space do you give each club if you get a big turnout? Yeah. Yeah. I think it's a great. Yeah. It just sounds great. We have a lot of card tables. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so we can just mark it that we'll bring that up into new business in October. Yeah. Uh, uh, yes, and could we put a tent talk to talk about a tentative date in February? Oh, that date may be in February, yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, anything else in club affair or club on? Um, C, review, review future house restoration and preservation projects. Oh, yeah, that says in October. Yeah, we can, let's, let's bring that up. Is there anything to bring up now? Mm -hmm. No? Okay. I think the only thing I might ask is that if um, we have that, we have those two spreadsheets, one that is um, restoration and preservation and the other is maintenance. Um, I don't know if they've been updated or if you need any help in doing that, but if there's anything, I mean, even Brittany, when we were walking around the house, found an, a, a spot that was like, oh, this is coming 
off of the wall the, the, near the wind. I was like, oh yeah, that's not on the spreadsheet. No. So, so it, it, have you seen me, a copy of the spreadsheet? You have the board members? Yeah, I'll, I'll yeah, remember. I can't see. Yeah. I, 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 I can't see. remember. I it was included in the. Um, both of them were included in the report, the annual report yeah, to right. city council. Right, it was it included on both yeah. of those lists. But I'd say maybe at, at some point, if not in definitely in October, we probably should be updating those lists. So if there's a good job for a house manager. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just say <laughs> so that when you saw you're gonna ask to watch out, right? <laughs> As, as Brittany yeah. was taking notes. <laughs> All right. Okay. I'll make sure, I'll make sure you have a working copy of that. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, okay. Yeah, maybe we could just kind of once or twice a year distribute it so everybody sees what's on the list or something. It's important. Yeah. Okay, moving on. Um, e Blast. That would be more of a Suellen thing. It's just on here as a regular reminder that any time that we're wanting to inform the public about anything regarding the Callahan House, that that's what she does and that she's available to do that. And she said, I'm willing to take any content you all would like and, and put it out there. So it's just a reminder for us to, this is one of them. Mm -hmm. right. And so um, this is, it's just a reminder for all of us to just Keep in mind if there's something that's coming up that it's coming up that we forgot about or that, that we, we need to want to put out there. We've the got to public discuss. About it. So we just want to leave it on. Just yeah. leave it on. Yeah, that's it's just a friendly kind reminder. of reminder yeah. every month, right? Okay. And the last item, and I don't know, the a, a closet organization is that something? Also, sounds out? like a great job for it's a friendly thing. To, to take on yeah, it. yeah, yeah. 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 that off for that reason. If yeah. you want to have a group thing, then great. Yeah. That would be really great. Yeah. So I know there's a lot of our. We just need to get stuff organized. up there, yeah. and, and it's through the years, so maybe that would be uh, to, rather than feel like, oh, guess what, Brittany, we're overwhelming the heck out of <laughs> um, we, you. Have volunteers that are here to help, yeah. or yeah. Yeah. So please yeah. take helping it, hands uh, are right here. here. Many times, so we'll leave it yeah, right here. Yeah. In, in yeah. a couple months, we'll, we'll look at that. I think it could be an educational thing too. Yeah. 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 It is. <laughs> Definitely. Sure. 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 It's yeah. when you re see things that you haven't seen for forever. Right. Like, oh, oh, yes. Yeah. Sounds All like right. donuts and coffee to me. We just got to be food in the, in the day. Yeah. Yeah. I need a food on that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, that covers our agendas. Before I ask for adjournments, anything else anybody wants to bring up? Um, I have one question quickly. Um, Maybe I'm forgetting what we decided to do, but there we don't have any financials this month. Oh, that's yeah, we didn't vote house. That's you're, you're, gonna, you're gonna have to give us just a pause on, okay. on that. But we also don't have a lot going on. Right, so that's kind of what I thought. Very slow. Well, it's not gonna happen. Didn't, 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 didn't we discuss that we're gonna look at it on a quarterly basis? That, that's the general plan. Yeah, that was and again, when about. we get going, get going with Sue Ellen. Okay. We'll, we'll really right. start to put that right. stuff back in place, but definitely on our minds because okay. that, that's it's important that yeah. we want to make sure you guys have good information. Thank you. And the information's there. Yeah. <laughs> it's all. It's just all happening. Not seen it, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but nothing. I mean, you know, there's nothing earth shattering. Right. One way or the other. Right? It's just okay. kind of generally slow. All right. All right. So um, with that, um, can I have a motion? We adjourn. I move that we adjourn. Uh,